Oh, Kimusabi. What the hell was that ending? Hey, what's going on, everybody? Today I'm going to talk about the ending of The Boys. I feel like everyone's been watching it. Everyone's done watching it. I recently just finished it. All of my friends from work were like, you got to finish it, you got to watch it, you got to watch it. I watched it. I finally finished it. And what do I have to say about the ending of The Boys? Honestly, it kind of pissed me off. I, I like the ending, and I'll tell you why. But it pissed me off, and I'll tell you why. I have not read the comics of The Boys. I'm going to. But what I did when I started watching the show is I was curious as to how the show was lining up with the comics. So I did a little, little research on it, and I kind of got a rundown of everything that happened in all the books. Spoiler talk, so if you don't want to know the ending or what I'm about to say from The Boys, stop watching. But anyway, you probably have seen it, so here we go. The ending of The Boys, the TV show, the Amazon Prime TV show, Billy Butcher is getting ready to kill Stillwell. Homelander's there, and that seems like it's the only thing that Homelander loves at this point is Stillwell. So he's going to kill her, you know, to get back at Homelander because he knows he can't do it himself. So Homelander kills her instead and leaves him kind of just like, you know, what the hell do I do? And the whole reason Billy Butcher wants to kill Homelander is because he raped his wife, which seemed like, and possibly killed her. That's what he thinks. Because she disappeared, no one knows where she is. So he, again, Homelander kills Stillwell. Butcher decides then at that point, okay, I'm just going to blow up the house now and just die and I don't know. So he does that, but Homelander takes him away really quickly before he can even blink. But when he wakes up, he's like, what the hell is going on? Where am I? And the show ends with Butcher's wife walking out with a child who he looks like he's like 10 years old. And as the child's walking out, you see Homelander approach the kid and he says, I'm your father. And Butcher's like, what the hell? My wife is still alive. She had a baby and it's Homelander's. And that's how the show ends cool ending right like yeah i mean i was like oh I, you know i i immediately i hated it though but then i was like i like it but I'll, again the reason i don't like it two reasons one is one from the comics and i'm, I'm being a, a hardcore geek right now because you know don't mess up the comics right but anyway in the comics butcher's wife is raped she has a child and i, I believe the child kills her as it's leaving the womb and Butcher kills the child because it's like this, you know, this damn baby with, you know, glowing eyes. Like, it's Homelander's kid. So, and Butcher kills the child some way, somehow. Again, I haven't read the comics, but I read up on it. Kills the child. Wife's dead. Child's dead. Therefore, that is his personal vendetta for Homelander in the comics. Okay. Right? So, in the show, Butcher's whole thing of why he started the boys was because Homelander killed his wife. Okay, so he's got reason, right? That's his reason. So now, when you take that reason away, which they did, they took that reason away, what are they going to do? Homelander can kill Butcher at any time. That, he can do that whenever he wants. Butcher's got nothing on him. But now, he sees that his wife is still alive. Therefore, he created this group for no reason now. So now, what does he do? Now, someone brought up a good point that I learned today was that his wife could be the doppelganger dude who is transforming into any person. That would be a cool twist. You know, I, I, that would be really cool. You know, he thinks it's his wife, and then later on, he'll be like, oh, it's not. And then we're back to let's kill Homelander and take care of the seven. Okay, I, I think that'd be a cool twist. But if it's not, and his wife is still alive, I just don't know where they can go with this. I mean, yeah, there are things they can do. But I don't know, we'll just have to wait and see until the second season. But that's why I hated the ending and I liked it. If I didn't read the comics and knew nothing about it, I would have appreciated that ending. But still, it's got a problem. It's got the problem of Butcher's reason as to why is now taken away. So what do we do now? So that's my thoughts on it. Let me know what you guys think. Did you enjoy the ending? Did you not enjoy the ending? Did you care that it was different than the comics or so on? And please subscribe because that helps me and in return I can help you. And thanks again for watching.